All right, Matt, 2010. Hope everybody had a safe holiday season. Hope everybody had a good New Year. My first video of the year. Basically, I'm watching a game here emulate between the Colts and the Texans. I'll get into reasons for that in later videos. And I see this pitch play, and it catches my eye because the angle of the pitch play is extremely severe. I mean, I'm amazed this play didn't gain yards. So I'm going to go back and take a look at it, and the uh, Madden Arcade advertisement is going to stay on the screen for some reason. But we'll just play this at speed, and here you can see a very severe angle on this pitch, I go back and I look at why, and I basically see a, a clipping issue. Uh, now the reason this is a problem to me is because we're, we're trying to simulate, emulate NFL football here, and technically in real life if this happens it's going to be a fumble. Uh, and we've also learned through videos that I've done and other people have done that the ball oftentimes can travel through players. In fact, Ian Cummings responded to those videos and said that it's just not possible, that the ball should only be able to travel through fingertips and toe tops that it would just be a clipping issue well this is more than a clipping issue and again the multiple problems with this because the ball goes through the Vonta Leach and I'm, I'm assuming this is a known issue I'm assuming more people have seen this that just because I don't play this game all that often that this is my first time experiencing it so as you can see with this pitch the ball actually travels through Vonta Leach to get to Steve Slayton now, as I said, in real life, unless Vonta Leach is going to catch this ball, which is highly unlikely, it's going to be a fumble. If you pitch a ball backwards and it inadvertently hits another player other than the one you were intending to go to, it's a fumble. The other problem with this is another example of players' bodies not being respected in this game. Now, I could deal with this if it were just a small clipping issue, if the laces of the ball kind of just grazed him. But this is the whole ball going through his body in order to get to Steve Slayton. The other issue, this allows a very abnormal angle, as I said in the, in the opening of the video, on this pitch. Because, again, you've got the ball going through the blocker to get to the halfback. So it allows you to have this very strong angle, which is initially what caught my eye, on this pitch. So hopefully this is something other people have seen. If you haven't seen it, now you have. Another issue I have with Madden, these, these clipping issues with the ball really have to go. And so do those little advertisements. I know I made a video that wasn't really well received about them, but it is kind of redundant that there's a Madden Arcade video in my replay. So, again, hope everybody had a good, safe New Year. I'll be definitely making more Madden videos. And uh, thank you guys for watching.